Here are today's top crime stories trending on lawandcrime.com and across the country. A woman in Philadelphia was arrested for killing her 11-month-old baby after she allegedly breastfed the child with drugs in her system. 30-year-old Samantha Jones of New Britain Township is charged with one count of criminal homicide after the autopsy of her baby, RJ, showed the infant died after ingesting breast milk containing methadone, amphetamine, and methamphetamine. The woman reportedly described herself as a drug addict to authorities and her other two-year-old son is in his father's custody. Jones is being held in lieu of $3 million bail. A police officer and elderly woman in Massachusetts were both killed by the officer's service weapon after an attacker was able to take the officer's gun during an altercation. 42-year-old officer Michael Chesna was in a car pursuit with suspect Emmanuel Lopez before Lopez wrecked his vehicle and fled on foot. In the ensuing chase, Lopez struck Chesna with a rock and took his firearm, fatally shooting the officer in the chest and head. According to authorities, Lopez then fatally shot a woman in a nearby residence before being arrested. Lopez now faces two counts of homicide. Two officers in Georgia were caught on body camera footage using a coin flip to determine whether to arrest a woman for speeding. The officers Kristen Wilson and Courtney Brown of the Roswell Police Department can be seen on video discussing whether to arrest or ticket the driver, Sarah Webb, who was doing 90 miles per hour in a 45 mile per hour zone. They had our tail. Okay. <laughs> this is tail, right? Yeah. So really, 23. Webb was subsequently arrested and charged with reckless driving, but the case was tossed once the body camera footage surfaced. The two officers were placed on paid administrative leave pending an investigation. Those were today's top crime stories. I'm Anthony Velez for Law and Crime.